Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. Uh, this is episode 30 of Diablo 4, and we're playing a necromancer here. And yesterday, our last episode, we were cut off uh, from the server, and when I logged back in, we lost all of our summons except the golem. So I went out and gathered welcome something before continuing our... Manor, traveler. I'm here about the instant. Donan gave me permission to look around. Incident. Okay, so remember we went through this house. Uh, we fought all those. So we were cut off and we came in down here. And yeah, so we're just uh, we're just replaying all of these things because uh, and then we'll read the sign. Okay, let us cut the. Uh, because we have seen that. Right, we we got engaged with a bunch of goat men or goat people. And Yep, we did this. Oh, there's a bunch of you. Oh. Yeah, we're just uh, repeating this because we have been in here and I think the rest of them are out in the courtyard. Many of the villagers were killed. Okay, uh, so this Don't is where we ended. They've never dared come so close to the estate before. Perhaps they were drawn by Lilith's presence. I saw a vision of her in your study. What do you mean, a vision? I don't fully understand how, but it isn't the first time. Full of surprises, aren't you? No wonder you caught Lorath's attention. Well, now you understand my predicament. The daughter of hatred in my own home. She must be furious I cast her out. That <laughs> painting on your wall. Who are the others in it? Why do you ask? Lilith seemed to leave after seeing them. The Fane and Arida. The druids who helped me slay Astaroth. Yes. Yes, I think you're on to something. I resisted her. So she might question them about the demon next. There are knights, 
stationed in villages near the druids. If Lilith passed through them, they yes, must have seen, seen her. Oh, there is a uh, teleport stone here. Okay. You know, it earlier it wasn't available. And now it's available. Good thing. Good thing I was looking around. Wow. Killed many of the peasants. Okay, so where are we supposed to go? Okay, um... Uh, Wait, what is our next mission? Uh, it, objective, search for evidence of Lilith near Braystag. Okay, uh, so I guess that's where we, we need to go. Okay. And what did we pick up? Uh, that was a Claw Sin. 388, a Lucky Hit Chance, 18 Strength, Shadow Damage over Time. No. Uh, no, we cannot use this. We already have, uh, man, uh, one rank. Oh, curse skills. This is not bad, actually. Uh, but that one is, uh, but that one has 58, uh, see, this one has one curse skills and rank to all corpse skills and damage reduction. Wow, this is a pretty good amulet. Uh, the thing is that it does not have... We'll be losing the uh, 58 thorns. <sighs> I wish that the uh, anime... Uh, the uh, legendary had the rare skill. Oh, then we... Okay, last one. Ok, 
Okay, uh, what are we supposed to be doing? Oh, we're supposed to come over here? Encroaching the shadows? Uh, search for evidence of Lilith near Bracetag. I think this was Bracetag, right? No, this is Freak Manor? This Menestad... Uh, that's a druid only. Uh, this one, we've finished that one. I guess this must be Brace Tag. Okay, okay, we need to go north. So this area is not what we're supposed to be exploring. What's down here? Okay, wait, where does that thing lead? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, let's, uh, we can do that, uh, but let us explore this area first. I wonder what's the significance of this area. Uh... Druid. Oh, this was this must be one of those. So, have we been here? Smuggler's Underpass I don't think we've been in there. Okay, let's just check this out Slain
nothing really nice. Okay, let's see what kind of rings we got. Uh, we have this, 329, Sever, 11 Intelligence, uh, 286, 352, uh, Cold Damage, oh, 10% minimum, a uh, maximum minions. Ah, it's so hard to give up the 10% uh, uh, maximum minion life. Uh, maximum, we get seven essence uh, damage over time, 352. So that's about uh, no, I don't know. It's kind of hard, right? Uh, because we've got we've got what uh, nine? No. Yeah, we have 10 minions, so that's 10%, including, uh, presumably, our golems. So we should have, uh, that 10% is enormous. It's like one additional minion. Wow, they're just giving us gold. Jeez. We need more stuff than gold. Well, that's a regular ring, so I won't even pick that thing up. Yeah, we're just getting gold, man. This doesn't even give it. Ah, uh, well, that that still makes sense because, uh, oh, cows. Oh, one thing we have not seen are the cow. Is is there? I wonder if there's a cow level in this game. Ooh, heavenly shield. I think, I think what we have is a uh, rare, or do we have a legendary? Oh, we have a legendary. Ah, <sighs> legendary three fifty-eight. Ooh, 
it's still less than the legendary oh the legendary is a level 20 only i mean level 20 yeah requires levels 20 minimum uh this one has 50 block 20 block 45 thorns which is like too short uh critical strike basic skill damage is 11 uh maximum minion life fifth okay that is good and then two per f a cost reduction as against lucky hit chance oh this is big this is big uh we are not getting the barrier active yet do we yeah the uh 358 power okay we will keep the shield uh, i mean i think i want to use this uh 13.5 maximum that will make our uh summons a lot more durable because we now have 10 and then plus Plus this, so we're talking about what's the durability? Uh, that's thorns. Oh, but did we give up any thorns here? Oh yeah. Oh no, we gave up two thorns. Uh. But we're giving up 13.5 maximum minion life. So that one plus... What's the other one? Uh, that's thorns. I think it's this one. Okay. This one is the maximum minion life. Okay, that's the pants. Oh, nine. Okay, so we're talking about... 12. Okay, anyway, uh, I think this would be a good place to cut the episode right here. Thank you guys for joining me. I hope you join me in the next episode. Bye!